Ready to unravel the mystery of those missing clips in Final Cut Pro? Today we're diving into a fix-it guide for those pesky red screens and learning how to reconnect those AWOL files. Let's get started. First, let's figure out where our videos are kept. To locate a clip, right-click on it in the browser. Then pick Reveal in Finder from the menu, or press Shift-Command-R to find it quickly. Got a clip, but can't spot it in the browser? No worries. Right-click on a clip in the timeline and select Reveal in Browser. That'll get you to the right place in the browser. Then click on the Reveal in Finder to show us where our videos hang out. Here, we can sort and arrange our video files. Now, if we change a clip's name, you might think it'd mess up the link in the browser, but nope. Final Cut Pro stays connected without any trouble. Let's try shifting things around in our folder. We'll make a fresh folder, give it a name, and copy all our videos there. Once the new folder's set, we'll get rid of the old one. When we head back to Final Cut Pro, we will be greeted by an error screen for the moved videos. Let's fix this. We need to reconnect our clips. First, pick a clip you want to fix. Then, head up to the menu bar and click File, then Relink Files, and choose Original Media. This cool Relink Files window will pop up in the middle of your screen. You'll spot the name of the clip you want to reconnect. Click Locate All, and a Finder window will show up. In the new folder, pick the right file we moved before and tap Choose. Check down here if the new file matches the clip. If everything seems right, hit Relink Files. The media files will connect again and bye-bye error message. Hey, before we move on, how about giving us a thumbs up? It tells me if I'm doing a great job explaining and helps others find this video. Thanks a bunch. We can also reconnect multiple missing files together. Click and hold Command, then tap on the clips that are missing. Now head to the menu bar, then File, then Relink Files and Original Media. You'll see all the clips you picked in the list. Click Locate All. Since they're all in the same folder, if we find one missing file, Final Cut Pro will find the others automatically. Double check if Final Cut Pro picked the right files. If it's all good, click Relink Files. Now all the missing clips are back and those red error screens are gone. Phew, no more worries about fixing your footage. Time to learn about render files. I'll show you the wrong way and the safe way to delete them. Then I'll show how to stop Final Cut Pro from taking up too much space in just one click. Click here to check it out.